even attempted the damn thing yet. Look at Dan over there. Get into your box. Dan sprayed just to get to his box. I I, I seen that, Dan. So promise that you'll catch me. What is going on, everybody? It's your boy Slab Train. Welcome back today, guys. Need for Speed 2015 back once again on the channel, man. Now, today we are back. We almost hit that damn gas station, man. We would have blew our asses up, man. I'm just kidding. They haven't updated that yet. But what they have done is probably one of the biggest updates to hit Need for Speed, man. Now, if you guys are living underneath of a rock, Obviously, if you guys are a fan of Need for Speed, you're going to know the updates. If you don't, let me go through them really quick, man. Now, first of all, we have been wanting this for a long time. Have a look at the bottom right. You're going to see my gears, man. We have manual transmission getting added into the game, and it it needed to be here, man. It really did right out of the box, though, I feel. you know, It, it, it did get a lot of hate for having you know just a standard transmission right out of the box for you know, a good what five months maybe how long has this game been out for man i think what november so yeah you know what i'm saying right you know it's been a little bit but thankfully they have added it in man they have taken in all of the consideration through the fans and uh that's what we wanted man the biggest thing was manual transmission i even said that that was one of the biggest things for the game and you know i stand by that and i feel like this is going to completely give the game a different feel and already man i feel like i'm playing a different game why because I'm shifting the damn car, man. I don't have to have the car do it for me. You know, I feel like I have a little bit more control now. I'm just, I'm, I'm more involved in the game, if that makes any sense. You know what I'm saying? So it just, it's a great update to have. And personally, one of the best ones that they could have done that people have just been wanting. Now, amongst the manual transmission, man, they have been treating us with free updates. And I will stress this right now. Free updates, man. For everybody that's saying, you know, eh, you know, Need for Speed has been doing the greatest you're right but they've been doing a lot of things right and you know they've been listening to the fans they've been listening to the damn community and i respect that you know what i'm saying i do respect the fact that we've already paid our money for the game and they're consistently rolling out free content good content as well too additional content for the game that is going to go a long way right so amongst that we do have hot rods and this is a brand new car feature that got added in and personally uh very excited to go and grab mine now unfortunately i don't know where the second hot rod is um there's only one in my garage that i can buy i think it's like two hundred and five thousand dollars, but it does come strapped with a nascar motor man so that's gonna be a hell of a lot of fun oh my god i still can't drive now there's two of them that we did get uh starting with the 1932 hot rod now what's nice with these is that it does come with four unique body kits and then each of them has a potential possibility to transform it into a soft top coupe sedan or pickup so i'm very excited to see how these are going to look we got a quite a bit of cash man we have i think we have what how much here 365 thousand dollars we have quite a bit the second hot rod that we did get was the beck customs f132 now if we go all the way over it's quite a bit of cars man jeez this is it right here the beck customs f132 now i don't see the other hot rod that is supposed to be here unless it's somewhere else um if i don't find it by the end of this episode just give me a little you know heads up in the comment section down below i greatly appreciate that and if you'd like to see more with the need for speed on the channel man don't forget to slap that like button we got lots of things coming in oh there she is the 1932 ford for 21 grand i like seeing that man Twenty one thousand bucks and oh man now i don't know which one to buy man you know what maybe we'll wait on that because that is a little bit cheaper um and i feel like i can get away with that a little bit later but we still have eddie's challenges to do and i'd like to at least attempt some of the drag races so this thing here looks like it comes you know fully built ready to go screaming 850 horsepower 10,000 rpm mid mounted v8 with a six speed transmission that oh my god that is gonna blow the doors off of anything that's in this list man let's go ahead and buy this shit man 202 grand with a 10 percent discount thank you appreciate it now the drag racing on the game i still don't know how to actually get into uh we're gonna find out exactly what is this here oh so we have a completely different warehouse that's dope because i was actually wondering i was like where do we put our other vehicles right i mean we have five more spots but it is at the other warehouse let's see where this warehouse is actually let's go ahead and uh move this over to there now the new oh whoa whoa no 
I want to go with it though. No, no, no. I, I, I would like to go with it. Is that possible? Collect from warehouse? Yeah. Okay. Well, so just sit there. Like, where's this other warehouse? I would like to see where this other warehouse is because I really hope that we can at least see the vehicles. Um, if, if we can't see the vehicles, you know, I don't know. I, I was actually really, you know, say hoping to have a full shot of 10 vehicles in my garage like GTA 5, but um, I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. I, I really would have liked them to all be in one spot. Uh, but, I mean, you get what you get and you don't get upset, right? I mean, that's that's the whole plan here. But let's just have a look. So that's the one warehouse right here. Where is the second warehouse now? We gotta find it. Maybe I'm blind. I don't know. I could be. Wouldn't be the first time. I'll tell you that right now. So I think that is our only warehouse. So it does look like that these cars, unless, unless, where's Manuel's warehouse? It was like over here, wasn't it? Can I just use... What? I want to use your warehouse, man, you. Come on, man. Stingy ass. Not not let me use his own warehouse? Okay, well. Where is he? You know, <laughs> little Batman. Oh, my God. There's no second warehouse. So it does look like that... Uh, oh, we got some damn company out here. What's good, gentlemen? You know, I've been thinking. What is a way to communicate to people... Without a horn, you know what I'm saying? Like, how do you do that? Now, this is what I'm thinking right here. It'd be like almost like a secret handshake, but for Need for Speed, right? You do a quick burnout. Just a quick one. Oh. Really? You don't gotta hit me, sir. There's other ways. I'm trying to communicate to you without hitting you. Okay, you know what? You don't wanna listen? A little bit disappointed that the warehouse is out of sight. That's really the only downside right now to this update. I haven't seen anything about this, right? So, I mean, I'm just going through this with you guys as I would be just picking up the game. So, you know, first thoughts... First impressions is essentially what we're doing right here. We're going to go ahead and move this back to our existing warehouse, right? Let's have a quick look, though, at... Holy shit. This thing is absolutely ridiculous. This is an F1 car strapped to a hot rod. This is exactly what this is. This is nuts. This isn't real, is it? I have to be dreaming. Like, this is a creation out of Mad Max almost. What is that noise? Did you guys just hear that? I'm using that with the triggers. I don't know what that is, but it sounds cool, though. Um, you can see the damn digital dash inside of that, too. That looks dope. This thing looks sick, man. It looks sadistic, to be honest with you. No performance modifications done to it. You cannot do anything to the tuning, but it looks like we can do something to the windows, and I guess that's just tinting them. That's it? Okay. That's fine. No body kits. Uh, no. Okay, yep. Uh, least we can do the ride height, and that is something, at least, right? We're gonna go ahead and slam this puppy, uh, track width. Can we do that? Oh, no, we can't. That would have been so cool to see. At least we can do the damn camber on the front and rear. Um, looks like only the front. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just leave it at neutral then, shall we? That's it. That's all that we can do, but we can do rims? Let's have a quick look what these are gonna look like. Oh my god, they look hideous! We only have one rim anyways, and that is... Okay. Well, that's cool, right? I, I guess. Yeah. One rim. No brake discs. No calipers. But we got tires, though. Okay. Um, slick tires. I like how you can see the tread pattern, though. That's actually really cool. We have rain tires. What? I've never seen that before. Rain tires, semi-slicks and slick and then the Beck custom so that's really cool so these may be specifically for the drag racing in general and that's why that those are there uh exhaust we can't even do no what's that spoiler oh we can do a spoiler we can take the spoiler off holy shit i'm doing that man let's go it's a drag car right we don't need that shit slowing us down and that's really about it now let's have a, one more look at this before we leave personally i think that looks so much damn cleaner than what we just had myself i do like that a lot and let's see what is trending for the paints now personally right off the bat first impressions of this car at least it is nuts man this thing is right out of a damn movie or something i don't know mad max you know something like that maybe like fast and the furious fast eight maybe this is gonna be in fast eight i don't know man that'd be absolutely nuts though if it is uh what's this here john player special that looks pretty cool I do like that. But I want maybe a little bit of colors, man. It's a hot rod. Let's treat it as such. We want some hot rod. Oh, shit. That's okay. No, no. I didn't ask for that, man. That's just, damn, something threw up on that shit. We got outlaw plastered on the side. That looks pretty clean. I like that. But what else we got? We must have some. Ooh. Eh. Too many flames. 
demon with the paint chips on there too yeah that is calling my name right there man now as well too for the paint and the editing for this we also had new animations indicating when a decal has been added to a vehicle improved animation to indicate more clearly the actual selected decal on the vehicle and speed up info text animation when showing an action happening so like i said this game has just got a massive overhaul this is the biggest update like i said of them all and personally really what we needed and you know i mean like i said with the new pc version coming down very soon i am personally very excited to redo this entire game with manual transmission i don't know about you guys but i am and i will be showing you guys the complete let's play with the wheel on the pc on the channel so if you guys are brand new don't forget to subscribe to the channel right now man do it right now now there's also some brand new trophies and collectibles uh drag queen which is win five drag race events wrap it up download a shared wrap and custom car buy your first hot rod so where's my achievement then sir i want my achievement stupid game notifications are off unfortunately but you know awakening dlc oh yeah i'll be i'll be playing you in a second man you know Oh, okay, there we go. 80 points for that shit. Hell yeah. And we got another 80 for buying our first car, man. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, that's clean right there. That's clean. I, I do like the fact that you can actually see your achievements right there. Like that. That's sick. I'm going to share that one on my profile. Now, it does also say on here that they did add more campaigns for rep, cash, and discount. So, I don't know what that's about. But, holy shit, this thing sounds nuts. A little second gear pull. I'm just kidding. Look at this 10,000 RPM limiter. Holy shit, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Jesus, man. I almost lost her already. Does this guy want to race? We got a wolf pack with us, though. Look at this shit. Excuse me, though, man. I gotta go. This thing is very twitchy. Holy shit. Excuse me. I almost died, too. Woo! <laughs> this thing is fast as hell, though, man. Handbrake is uh, not the greatest, I'll tell you that. I, Jesus, man, I couldn't even throw that. Let's try to throw it right here. Oh, my God. Okay, so, uh, I don't think that this model is really made for drifting. It's really not, man. I mean, a little bit, but shit, man. Not that much, though. Obviously, it's a drag car. I, I, I can already see the comments right now. Slap, what the hell are you doing, man? It's a drag car, and you're trying to drift it. Smarten your ass up, man. I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry. But we need to do some of our challenges, though, man. I'd like to do the drag racing. I just don't know where that is. What the? Where's the drag racing? Someone come and please help me out. This is some bogus. Where's our drag races? All right, so we found the drag racing. It's anything with these double damn flags. I wish it made it a little bit clearer to find out where they were, but we found them, though, man. At least we found them. Jeez. Now, we still have to build the hot rod. I'm thinking about doing an online episode, maybe with a couple buddies, building up the hot rods for you guys on that. That should be a hell of a lot of fun. Don't forget to come on back for those. Um, what the hell is going on here? Burn out the perfect amount to maximize your rev sweet spot. Then get in the box and keep the needle in the zone to get a perfect launch. Remember, this is manual gears event, so every shift counts. Okay? So it sounds a lot like Pro Street. Um, so let's go ahead and give it a shot, man. I don't know exactly what the hell is going to happen here. You made it. You are going to love this. Let me walk you through it. Okay. Drag racing oh, is all about we're racing Frederick, eh? Timing. Place your car within the start area and do a burnout to get your tires to the perfect temperature for maximum grip. But don't overdo it. Okay, so we just burn it. Yeah, I'm burning it. And then what? Try for a perfectly timed start. Oh! Like fraction of the second you shave off counts. We got it. There you go. Now oh, never mind. We're spinning tires. Okay. Sorry, Frederick. Jesus. Okay, that one. That was a little confusing, man. We had a lot of time in that box. I didn't think we had that much time. But obviously, that Volvo down there. Yeah, he's, he's gone. Holy shit. 
This thing is so fast, man. Oh my god. That's your first drag race. <laughs> Looks like you got the hang of it. Yeah, it's great, girl. It's great. Okay, so first thing is this is not what I remember from drag racing. Now, obviously, you know, it is an involvement, or sorry, it's an evolution of the series, right? So my drag racing that I remember, and this is what I thought was going to be happening, was the old school Need for Speed Underground 2 drag racing, where you would then, you know, almost travel to a different area and then run the drag race where you would only be able to steer into the different lanes. I thought that would have been really cool for this one. Um, but I mean, it's just kind of like a free for all kind of thing. You can just do whatever you want, but it would have been nice to kind of go back to, you know, the roots of the drag racing, right? I mean, that's, that's just me though. I would, I would love to know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Do you prefer it where you can do whatever you want? Or would you have preferred to have the old school style lane switching drag racing? Let me know in the comment section down below, ladies and gentlemen. Let's give this thing another shot. Try to get these tires at a perfect roast, man. The only thing we roasting today is tires, man. That's it. Hopefully, anyways. Ready to get up to the box? Look at how far the box is, man. I'm already doing like 300 by the time I get there. I'm just kidding. I'm really not. What? What the hell just happened right here? I just... Okay. I just sit here now? What? Oh my... Shit! No, no. I, I would like a restart, please. Restart! Thank you. Let's see what we got. I just don't understand the burning out system. Like, is it just... You just burn out until that's it? Like, I, I just don't get it. Let's try this again. Okay, so pressing all the burnout, burnout meters on the bottom. What? So you have to hold the burnout. You can't just stop and go. You have to hold it and do it as long as you want. I thought you, you know, you could do it until the time runs out. Don't let go of the damn brake because you will just sit there, all right? Let's try this again. All right, Wayne, this one's mine, man. This one's mine. We're good, we're good, we're good. All right. Overcooked. Cool. Let's see where we can get the proper launch, man. Maybe it's like the third bar in there? I don't know. We overcooked them and we waited to the fourth one. Let's try number three instead. I don't know. We'll see. I just want to just go. Yes, I'm going to join it every single time. Just let me restart the damn thing. Okay. Here we go. So let's try this. We're gonna do number three. Okay, number three works. Now we just have a long ass wait now though. That's the only thing. Got a hell of a better launch though. Holy shit, let's go baby. Burning out that damn fifth gear. I'm sorry. This thing is so twitchy, though. It's nuts. Oh, that man's so far behind. Two out of three. These are some long-ass drag races, though. Holy shit. That's it. And we died at the very end, too. How come my damn guy can't drive properly? Come on, man. Treat my damn car with care when I give it to you. AIs just think it's just damn free, you know? They can just crash it however many times they want. Hell no, man. I gotta fix that shit every time. And one of my lights are gone. Look at that. Oh, man, I'm pissed. Drag the town. Medium. Let's go, man. I'm, you know, I'm understanding this now, but I would have liked it to be a little bit easier to understand. Like, they just give you, you know, five dots and you gotta hit the dots, right? I mean, which dot do you hit, you know? It's just like a guessing game, but, I mean, it's all the fun of doing it. Here we go. Just good old street racing, man. Still, I'm going back to that old school Need for Speed drag racing, though. You know, it just... That's where I remember that shit. And not just one and two cars. It would be, you know, four... I think four cars going at it. We're in the box. We're in the box. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Yep. Let's try just number two. Oh, it's good again. But not as good as number three, though. I'm in reverse. 
What do you mean fail, man? I barely even did it. Look at this chopper guy, man. Come on now. I feel so bad. Oh, Jesus. Okay, now, now we gotta play catch up a little bit. See if we can run him down. No spray. Of course we can, man. We got a NASCAR motor in this shit. No problems whatsoever. Definitely would have liked to see maybe, you know, four car lineup. Again, going back to the old school underground too. And I know what you're thinking, man. Slab, come on, man. Don't be so damn picky. I'm not being picky. I'm just giving you guys my thoughts and, you know, my kind of memories from Need for Speed. Because, I mean, let's be honest, we're all basing our past experiences on this game, right? I mean, Need for Speed in the franchise, in the series, you just think, you know, from past Need for Speeds. You know, I, I've been playing Need for Speed for as long as I can remember. So, you know, I mean, when I give you guys my feedback and thoughts, it's just, you know, it's nothing like, oh my god, man, I'm, I'm never playing this shit ever again, or this is terrible. It's just, just giving you guys my honest thoughts and opinions, man. That's it. Um, Speed time. Oh, I hit the damn wrong one. Okay, here we go. Drag racing is definitely fun. Um, I I think it's really going to shine online, though, when you can really go online. And if we are able to do these online with other people, I pray that we can do up to four people or the maximum party, which I haven't attempted the damn thing yet. Look at Dan over there. Get into your box. Dan sprayed just to get to his box. I, I, I seen that, Dan. I seen that. <laughs> Shit. I didn't mean to do that. And they gave me this little damn box right here. I got it though. Holy shit. I can't believe I did that. Maybe give us a challenge or some shit, man. You know I'll be bringing a damn hot rod to these events. I haven't had one challenge this entire time, man. Okay, that was a little damn treacherous on the map. It looked a hell of a lot different than what it was. Let's just go ahead and spray all our damn nitro. We're already maxing this shit out anyways. All right, so with that being said, that's the new Need for Speed update, ladies and gentlemen. Big thank you to everybody letting me know in the comments, on my Facebook, on my Twitter about this, you know, dropping when it did. Um, I would love to know your thoughts, opinions, your feedback, what you think they should still add into the game, but the manual transmission, uh, you know, is huge, and that is, on, I, I would say, the biggest update of them all, man. This is the update of all updates, is really what it is. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy this episode. What is this, man? Neck to neck. Let's go. What do I do? What do I do? The event is full, eh? Oh, then why'd you ask me to join? What the? Oh, oh. let's do it again. Okay. What is this? I feel like I'm gonna get taken into a damn alleyway and get my car stripped or some shit. I don't know. Never let the drift train leave you behind, man. Words to live by right there. What is this? Oh, are, are we online? I think we're online right now. I think I just answered my own damn question. This guy brought a Civic to a drag race. You got it, sir. Why are we in sixth gear? Where's this guy? Sweater 24-7, man. You better be ready. Look at him. Yeah, your little front-wheel drive, man. You got it. This guy's gonna be done. Another thing that I really would have liked on the drag race, and I just thought of this right now. Holy shit, man. We're not getting beat by a Honda. No. No. Are you, are you kidding me right now? No. Honda's never win, man. Look at that. Oh my god. We we almost lost that shit. Oh my god, man. We almost got beat by the Honda. I would have had to sell the game. I would have had to retire on YouTube. Oh my god. It would have been catastrophic. Holy shit. I'm just kidding, man. No offense to Hondas or anything, but damn, I was not expecting that, man. Oh my god. If you guys don't know me, I, I, I love Hondas. I have a damn special necklace that I wear that has a Honda damn emblem on there for my previous CRX. So, I mean, I got no hate against Hondas whatsoever. It's all joking manner. So, you guys don't get all rustled up in the comments about me that, you know what I'm saying? But, that guy just gave us a run for his money, man. We're out here damn chirping his Honda and we would have lost if he didn't hit that damn car. So, that would have been... Is he challenging me again? Oh, my God. I, I feel like I owe it to him. I really do.
sweater. There he is. Oh, shit. He's back. I wish you could invite him to a damn drag race from here. That'd be nice. On green? I'm going for it, man. I'm just kidding. It's already green. Oh, he's like, okay, well, it's green then. Go roll racing right here. Let's go. Let her fly, man. Let's go. Oh, this is drag race right up there. Hopefully, we get sweater 24 7 again. Who's is this now? Come on. Race number two. Oh, we got Killer Ghost. Okay. This is my pit box, sir. What the hell are you doing, man? Game lined us up on the wrong side of the road, eh? Okay. Alright, we got good. Who am I driving against? Is it Killer Ghost? I can't even see his pit box. Ah, uh, that green light seemed a little fast on that shit. Take care, my dude. I would have liked to see the Civic again. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys very much for coming around for another episode of Need for Speed. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to slap that like button, man. Show your support in the comment section down below. And as always, too, guys, if you're brand new, don't forget to subscribe. Become a member of Team Slap today and start spinning some damn rubber with us. As well, too, you guys can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. All of which are found in the description box down below. Need for Speed Update 2015. Jamoto Slab Train. I'm out. Peace. Oh my god. What is going on everybody? It's your boy Slab Train. And welcome back guys.